अगर आप मुझे पूछोगे जे एडवांस क्रैक करने के लिए सबसे इम्पोर्टेंट चीज क्या है देन माई आंसर वुड बी कंसेप्चुअल क्लैरिटी जे एडवांस में क्वेश्चन बार बार रिपीट नहीं होते बट कंसेप्ट कंसेप्ट कभी भी नहीं बदलते अब सोचो एक ऐसा स्टूडेंट जिसको हमेशा नए क्वेश्चंस को अवॉइड करने का मन करता था जिसको जे एडवांस के नाम सुनते ही डर लगता था पर उसने फिर भी कुछ ऐसा सिंपल और मैजिकल किया कि उसका रैंक ए आई आर थ्री आ गया एक ऐसी रैंक जो उसने खुद भी कभी इमेजिन नहीं करी थी ये कहानी सिर्फ एक रैंक की नहीं है ये कहानी है हाउ हार्ड वर्क कैन साइलेंटली बिट दि बिगेस्ट फीयर्स और ये वीडियो आपको बस एक ही पॉइंट प्रूव करेगा हाउ हार्ड वर्क बिट टैलेंट वेन टैलेंट डजेंट वर्क हार्ड चलिए शुरू करते हैं Distractions was mainly watching anime. anime. Like every weekend I used to watch anime. So you were addicted, kind of addicted uh, to kind of anime. Addicted, yeah. So how did how did you tackle this issue? Please, I kindly request. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know any pickup line? Pickup line oh, on movie, like movies pickup line not. You mean it means you don't know? Uh. <laughs> pickup line is a line to pick up girls. Pick up girl. Okay, flirting. Like uh, uh-huh. I don't like I'm. I don't know about all this stuff. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Today we have Sandesh with us, who cracked J Advanced with AI R three, and today we are going to know his story, know his tips and secret, and a very interesting story story about him, which I heard yesterday. So, Sandesh, first you introduce yourself. Hi, everyone. My name is B Sandesh, and I am. I studied in Narayan Hyderabad in a five year program from eighth to twelfth class. And I wrote, I gave my JEE in 2024, and I secured AR3, and I'm very happy about it. But I didn't expect I would get AR3. I'm I'm here to like give tips and tricks so that even you can score good at JEE advanced exam. Yeah. So uh, you told me yesterday that uh, it is just a luck that you got AR3. I mean, J there is a luck factor, but getting AR3 is not merely dependent on luck. You have to study for it, right? Yeah. So, first of all, tell me why do you think like you didn't deserve this kind of rank? Uh, like, I think I didn't deserve this rank because my plus point is only like hard work. And once I do a like uh, like one type of model question, then I can do any type of model which similar to that. Like, I can't like solve a question which is new to me. But that's what J Advance test. J Advance asks the questions like the same concept but different question. So, if we have like practice enough models, you can solve any type of question in J Advanced. Okay, so you are saying that you are very good at solving same type of questions, uh-huh. and if and a new the, conceptual question arrives, you are you feel it uh, difficult, difficult to solve it. And J Advanced asks like eighty percent. Yeah, J Advanced is all about concept only. Ah, uh, eighty percent questions will be like known to us. But you also mentioned that you are a very hard working student, right? Ah, uh-huh. and you are not. Very talented in that aspect that you mm-hmm. can't solve new type of question. Uh, I'm not very. But talented. your hard work has beaten that thing because yeah. you eventually cracked it, right? So the point I'm trying to make here is that he he tried so many questions, so many questions that after a certain period of time, even if a new conceptual question arises, he was able to solve it. Ah, uh, yeah. Right. Mm. So practice is the main secret. Uh, practice is your, main secret. Yeah. Got it. So you already mentioned that you started your JEE preparation from your. Eighth class. Eighth class, mm-hmm. but you were not very serious in eighth, ninth, and tenth, as we talked uh, before. Yeah. You told me that thing, and what happened that you became serious in eleventh and twelfth? Uh, like when I became, when I came to eleventh, like after understanding the, like I was able to understand the concept to a core. Till tenth class, I was just like uh, something is going on, and I was studying something. Like at, after eleventh class, uh, while my teachers are teaching to me, I felt the real depth in the concept, and uh, I felt interested to study. Then I started studying seriously. So till tenth, you were just uh, just going to the classes, nah, just, going just to solving the questions which teachers gave you. Nah. Were not that enthusiastic, or you were not enjoying the process. Nah. But after eleventh, you started enjoying the concepts. Nah. That is what you are saying. Nah. Okay. Hey, just like you have heard that tenth, till Sunday, he was studying. But in eleventh, he got very good teachers. Then he started understanding the real depth of the concepts. Ki asli depth पर ये तो संदेश की कहानी थी हर किसी के लाइफ में ऐसा मोमेंट नहीं आता है जब वो अपने पोटेंशियल को अचीव कर सके या फिर अपने ड्रीम कॉलेज में जा सके अपने ड्रीम्स कंप्लीट करने के लिए तो कुछ लोग तो इतनी बड़ी मिस्टेक कर लेते हैं ना कि उनको अगर अपना ड्रीम कॉलेज नहीं मिला तो रैंडमली कोई भी कॉलेज चूज कर लेते हैं एंड देन वो फिर ऐसे कॉलेजेस मिस कर लेते हैं जिसका प्लेसमेंट एंड रियल वर्ल्ड एक्सपोजर बहुत अच्छा है 
बस इजी एडमिशन के चक्कर में एवरेज कॉलेज ले लेते हैं इसीलिए मैं आज बात करने वाला हूँ वॉक्सन यूनिवर्सिटी के बारे में जिसका कैंपस 200 एकड़ में फैला हुआ है एंड जिसका बीटेक प्रोग्राम ट्रूली नेक्स्ट लेवल है एंड हेयर यू विल गेट फाइव न्यू एस स्पेशलाइजेशन सी एस सी सी एस सी डेटा साइंस सी एस सी ए आई एम एल सी एस सी आई ओ टी साइबर सिक्योरिटी ब्लॉक चेक एंड ईसी भी है करिकलम इज प्योर प्रैक्टिकल फोकस फिफ्टी परसेंट तक की लर्निंग इंटर्नशिप है प्रोजेक्ट लाइव इंडस्ट्री प्रॉब्लम ऐसी होती है लैब रोबोटिक्स हाई एंड कंप्यूटर्स आई आई टी लेवल एक्सपोजर एंड ग्लोबल एक्सपोजर के बारे में तो क्या ही बताओ तीन सौ ऐसी ज्यादा स्टूडेंट पचास ऐसी ज्यादा कंट्री में गए हैं सेमेस्टर एक्सचेंज के लिए विद क्रेडिट ट्रांसफर्स 2024 में 100 परसेंट प्लेसमेंट हुई थी हाई सीटी वो ट्वेंटी फोर एल पी एंड टॉप ट्वेंटी परसेंट का एवरेज था 11.5 पॉइंट फाइव एल पी एंड देर आर रिक्रूटर्स फ्रॉम गोल्डमैन सेक्स ओर एक्ल माइक्रोसॉफ्ट डीओलॉइट एंड मिनिमम फॉर एंट्रेंस यू कैन हैव वॉक्स इन जेई या फिर जेई मेन वी आई टी ई एम एस टी सी टी ई एम सी टी सी यू टी विद बेस्ट ऑफ टू स्कोर पॉलिसी एंड फाइनल स्टेप होता है पर्सनल इंटरव्यू देर आर ऑल्सो स्कॉलरशिप अप टू फिफ्टी परसेंट बेस्ट ऑन मेरिट तो अगर आप भी अपनी फ्यूचर इंजीनियरिंग की जर्नी स्ट्रॉन्ग करना चाहते हो तो वॉक्स एंड यूनिवर्सिटी जरूर कंसिडर करो आई हैव गिवन द लिंक्स इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन यू कैन गो एंड चेक इट आउट फॉर मोर इन्फॉर्मेशन नाउ लेट्स कंटिन्यू अवर वीडियो वॉट वॉज येली स्कड्यूल योर ड्यूरिंग योर इलेवंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ ड्यूरिंग माई इलेवंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ वी स्टार्ट एट एट ओ क्लॉक एंड वी एट एट लंच वी एंड एट ट्वेल्व फोर्टी आफ्टर लंच वील स्टार्ट एट टू ओ क्लॉक अगेन टिल टेन थर्टी ओके लाइक इट वॉज यूज टिल टेन टेन थर्टी या ओके दैट इज अ वेरी टाइट स्केड्यूल Did you used to give equal time to all the subjects? Yeah, kind of. Yeah, like we'll give four hours to each subjects, hmm. and sometimes three and a half to one subject. Like okay. What was your most favorite subject among PCM? My favorite subject was mathematics. Mathematics. Ah. Okay. And what are the books you used for PCM? Uh, the books I used are like for maths. I just followed the questions given by my teachers, hmm. and then there was like one website called Math Colio. It's made by our master, and it's very good for J aspirants. I okay. recommend you to like go to the website and check it once. Okay. The okay. I will also link that l- uh. link in the description so that you can go through it. And for chemistry, I would say like first read NCERT perfectly, and then like it will be better if you read like J daily like basics of J daily, not every entire J daily, required amount of J daily, and for organic chemistry, mm, like reading. Peter Sykes and Peter Sykes is not needed actually. No, just read NCERT for organic chemistry. Okay. And for physical chemistry, Neeraj Chopra is better. Got it. And for physics? And for physics, uh, Shashi Bhushan Tiwari helps us a lot. And HCV, like HCV. everyone will say HCV. Like <laughs> HCV, HCV is like, needed. HCV is uh, such a book that you don't have to mention it. It is uh, by default uh, there for default physics. Thing. Yeah. Now, when you were preparing for J, there must have been a point where you were stuck in a certain topic. Like yeah. was there any situation like this? Yeah, yeah. Like it took so many effort for you to understand that particular topic. So first, tell me what was that topic? Um, like in my two like five years of coaching, uh, I felt difficult in mainly in physics, and in physics, my weakest topic was electromagnetic induction. Electromagnetic uh, induction. Like okay. uh, if I get doubt, I used to ask my teacher like again and again, and he used to say it. But uh, even now, like I feel somewhat difficult in that topic. Keep going on like uh, even if you not get it, like stick on to it and read and read and read. Then you will get at that some point you will be perfect in that. So the way you tackled it, you kept on trying. Ah, uh, like I did not like leave give up. up, give up. Yeah, got it. Hard work needs discipline. Yeah. So what is your secret of discipline? How were you so disciplined during your preparation? Ah, uh, I used to like prepare a plan or in a paper like what should I do today? Like okay. kind of things like a to do list. Ah, uh, to do list. Make a to do list and. Each work keep time. How much time will you do? And like take keep a timer or like you have watch like keep timer and then uh, do it strictly like keeping or like devices aside like just you paper and question no, nothing else like g- give your effort hundred percent in it and daily like if you do daily then you will get happy to do that. Got it. So one uh, good point he mentioned is that making. a to do list is not enough he also allocated time for every task yeah. he yeah. is giving so that it is completely planned it is not randomly that i will do 10 tasks and you don't know how much time it will require and you end up doing only half of them but allocating time will actually give you the real perspective so first do try to apply those things and see if it works for you there is also an application named notion which you can use where you can perform all those activities very seamlessly basically So, uh, were there any distractions while you were preparing? 
like the smartphone or any other kind oh. of distractions my distractions was mainly watching anime like Achha. i like really like anime and every weekend i used to watch anime what um, is your most favorite anime my favorite most favorite is like uh, naruto naruto like naruto uh, i was mm-hmm. about to say that okay now coming back to the question so you were addicted to, kind of addicted uh, to kind the of anime addicted, yeah so how did how did you tackle this issue uh, like i kept like every weekend at last uh, at sunday mm-hmm. we used to get some time mm-hmm. like what i decided was i'll give my time the time to anime mm-hmm. and rest of the week i'll work hard okay like i was like keeping my telling myself that you have time certain time so watch that time but okay got it and do you have any unique study techniques which you which helped you a lot unique i mean that is like discovered by or introduced by yourself no like i uh, didn't yes, have so you just like used to do like, what teacher uh, used to tell i just follow i just followed the teachers what they said okay so apart from watching anime what other activities you used to do during your jeep trip like uh, for we, fun or for time pass uh we we used to play table tennis table in tennis. our campus Achha. like i really like table tennis but i am not that like i am weak in that but i like so what advice would you give to the j aspirants who are aiming for the top rank the advice i would give is like just uh like don't uh, solve questions more like solve questions but quality questions okay. and then stick to limited content like revise 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 like the limited content only don't like try to do all the things at once and uh, like be confident and like give your best and do a do your full give a full effort do hard work okay. and that's that's enough for j advanced i give the nothing to do with j advanced like if you are feeling you are not intelligent like it has nothing to do with j advanced you just need to do hard work and you can succeed in j advanced that is a very good point you have made here that even if you are not that talented you can still crack j advanced mm. with the hard work yeah i mean you can do anything with the hard work if you have that kind of dedication you mentioned revision uh, as a very important thing while preparing for uh-huh. j so what was your method of revising topics my method was making a short notes like uh, if you take a subject and chapter i used to write all important points in small book and for every chapter and each subject okay. that will help a lot and apart from short notes you should read ncert ncert revision is needed because for mains and for advanced also it's needed for chemistry were you aware that your rank is going to be single digit oh i mean okay it was in my questionnaire but you were not aware right no <laughs> but then when you saw that number 3 in your portal what was your reaction because you must be surprised at that moment what was mm. the reaction my reaction was like uh, i didn't expect my rank huh mm, like i was uh, okay with if i get like below 100 if it is below 100 i was like too happy Uh, but when i got 3 i was shocked like you were shocked uh, oh bro is it my result only uh, or it is someone else's <laughs> okay now we'll start the fun part i want you to introduce introduce yourself in a regional language regional regional language yeah, your regional language okay na peru sandesh nenu na ma uru kannullo adone na uru and chal Wait, it's fine. It's fine. This much is fine. No worries. So your expectations versus reality of IIT. Now that you have came here, uh, my expectations were completely different than the reality. So I am struggling a lot right now. It okay. Would... So you expected that you will come here and you will just enjoy. Uh, like But I now you have what, to study program. Uh, yeah. What I thought is like we can after J advance, it's complete nothing. Like we can do very easily. But I got to know that we should study here also. Like it's not like we can just leave everything. We should study. We should give our best. Only then we can succeed here also. You will succeed here as well, considering your habit of working hard. Do you watch movies? Nah, no, like I am into like most of the movies, web series, yeah. anime, all those. So, can you express your thoughts from a via a movie dialogue or something like a very famous movie dialogue which you resonate with yourself a lot? It Myself. might be regional or any movie, any movie. Yeah. Like which resonates myself? Huh? Which which huh? you resonate with? I don't know. Please, I kindly request. <laughs> I like that dialogue a lot. <laughs> okay, you know Nandan Nilekani. He is an alumnus of IIT Bombay. He recently donated rupees three hundred fifteen crores to our college. Okay. Now, assume if he had given that money to you, mm-hmm. what would you have done in that case? Uh, like I would divide into some categories and 
फर्स्ट इज लाइक टू गिव एन ऑर्फनेज एंड सेकेंड इज लाइक लाइक समथिंग गिफ्ट टू माई फैमिली ओके वॉट विल यू डू ऑफ दैट मनी मीन्स वॉट विल यू डू अपार्ट फ्रॉम कीपिंग इट टू योर फैमिली वॉट विल यू डू लाइक ऑफ दैट मनी The one thing is I'll give to orphanage. Ah, uh-huh, huh? that I know. And you like, want to buy something? No, no. I would like to make like education proper. So I'll make some one school and uh, like have some certain rules and make it bigger. Okay. Um, do you know any pickup line? Pickup line on movie like movies pickup line or? You mean it means you don't know? Ah. Uh-huh. <laughs> pickup line is a line to pick up girls. Pick up girl. Okay, flirting. Like uh-huh. I, like I'm. I don't know about all this stuff. <laughs> okay. Now, if you could travel in time and you can go back to history, whom will you meet? I'll meet Aristotle. Aristotle. Uh, because okay. he made all this ruckus. Like, if he was not there, huh. the entire thing will not be there. Which thing will not be there? Like the entire revol- uh, evolution. Like evol- evolution of thinking. Why? Okay. So you have problem with that thinking. Yeah. Why you want to put your own thinking? <laughs> no, not like that. But so, what is the problem? Is what if he put that theory? What is the problem with that theory? Like because of that, I was study. I am studying philosophy now. <laughs> okay, so that is the problem. Ah, that's the problem. <laughs> okay. Uh, assume now tomorrow morning you wake up and you are of opposite gender. Okay. What will you do? The what is the first thing you will do? First thing I'll do. I'll check my voice. <laughs> okay. If you could be CEO of any company for a day, mm. which company you will choose? Uh, If you could choose CEO of any, huh? Microsoft. You will choose Microsoft. Okay. One superpower you wish you had. Superpower. Spiderman powers. Spiderman powers. So with that said, this video is has ended. Thank you so much, Sandesh, for joining us and sharing your story. And the secret of your success is hard work. So. follow it do you want to say something at the end uh i would just say that even if you are like feeling low right now don't worry and take support and do a continuous hard work you will succeed in your j advanced preparation perfect so bye bye guys see you soon